Welcome back everyone, I'm Craven and this is a Juden Chronicle Rising. Last time we finished the main story, but there are still things that we need to complete. And it is the remaining quest to uh, fill up our stamp card. And these were not available before we ended the story. So is it technically post-game related? Uh, I don't really know about that, but I, I feel like the original one on the 60th, which takes us to the end of the black stamp card, I think those are from the original game and the 160 you get after that are just bonus content just to keep, make you keep playing to uh, fulfill all the remaining goals you have in this game. So we're gonna at least complete these uh, in our episode. So like I said last time, I think there's gonna be like two episodes worth of content uh, quest-wise. So for now, uh, we're gonna open up a few more quests around town basically every single one we can find and then we're gonna go back into the dungeons to pick up what we can find I already know where a couple of them are from the quest we already opened up but I'm thinking if we pick up the remainder of the quests we might be able to pick up even more things because it does feel like the quests we've picked up so far are more like personalized items instead of resource gathering wise so if we have those, we can do them exactly at the same time. So uh, let's head to the plaza and see where the other quests also are. I think it's mostly uh, all the stores. Mostly, not all of them, of course. Uh, Sarita, Tatara, Bertrand, Frida, Rajiv, Squash. Yeah, we, we need to go by almost all the stores. The only two, well, two different on the list is Outskirts. Jochen is actually at the Great Forest? Oh, probably the guy in front of the entrance of it. Well, like I said, we probably need to be in the forest for other quests as well, so... Room quarter, out in the lane, town outskirts... Seems like there are like three or four quests on the outskirts of town. I guess... Uh, that's the best uh, places I need to uh, pick up some more quests. Ooh. I found your bag. I haven't looked inside or anything, but from what I can tell. Is it just a charm? Shh, I told you to keep it between us, didn't I? Yes, it's a charm. That's why I couldn't uh, go back uh, in and get it myself. Don't tell me. You were afraid to go into the quarry without that uh, tiny little thing? Of course I was. That's what it's for. You want to be mad to go in there without protection but uh, I appreciate you going in there to get it for me here the stamp just take care of it from now on okay well, on my end if he doesn't we have the potential of another stamp Oh, I'm so sorry everyone. So sorry. Uh, are you okay? You don't look too good. Oh, sorry to be cursed, miss, but please leave me alone. I... I... Ah! Kukrit! Kukrit? This guy? Isha, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for letting your father die. Oh, please do not blame yourself, Kukrit. He would be happy knowing you had survived. Exactly. Blaming yourself for what happened is no way to live. CJ. He, he gave me this bag. Told me to escape. Bag? I, I remember. I was attacked by monsters on my way out. The bag. It tore open and... Uh, I just kept running and everything fell out. But it's probably still down there in the barrows. Do you really believe so? Yes, I do. I don't know exactly uh, what he had in there, but I'm sure it must have been dear to him. Hmm, dear to him. As acting mayor, I believe it's my duty to investigate this. Nah, you're busy enough. You should leave this to me. Right, uh, Kukrit? Poor Isha's got a lot on her plate as it is. Oh, that's right. Besides, I need more stamps on this card, don't I? Leave it to me, Isha. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, hi? Are you local? 
I thought I knew pretty much everybody around here. Well, you must be CJ. I'm buff. You wouldn't have seen me about. I don't get out of the house much. Why is that? You okay? Well, I'm guessing you've heard about the expedition that went into the barrows. I was supposed to be on it. Oh, really? Well, I had a rough fever that morning though, so my brother took my place. He never came back home. My brother used to make note of everything, especially my blunders. He never managed to track down his notebook though. CJ, if you happen to find a notebook down there in the barrows, would you mind bringing it back to me? I'm sure my brother will have filled it with plenty of colorful language. But I wouldn't give to read uh, his ramblings again. No problem, buff. I will find any notebooks, I'll bring them here. Alright, so I'm guessing we're gonna have a full rundown of the barrows uh, later, cause we have three pieces of scrap, four notes. I think with all the quests combined, we need to walk the entirety of the barrows probably. Excuse me, miss. I I'm super hungry. Do you have anything to eat? <laughs> I don't, but I can get you something. What would you like? Uh, Dory, you're so small you can only eat small stuff. I guess what my papa says. I like teeny tiny fish. I'm mean, I'm so hungry, I could eat a bajillion of them. A bajillion, huh? Leave it to me, I'll see what I can do. Ooh, yeah, we have more than uh, enough fish for that. Still hungry, Dory? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I should give you a stamp, shouldn't I? Before that, where are your parents, Dory? Oh well, I came here with Papa, but they uh, shut the shut the qu quarry, and he can't uh, go to work no more. Now he says uh, there will be another war, so he left to be a mi missionary. He told me to wait here in town. Is that so? But I used all the money he left me already. And Dory, anytime you want fish, you find me and let me know. I'll get you as many as you can eat. And if you can't find me. Go straight to Isha. If you can't find Isha, go see Sarita at the tavern. Tell her CJ sends you. I promise there ain't a soul in this town that would see you go hungry. Or lonely. Okay. That's actually quite sad. A single dad has left his only child behind alone in town with just some pocket change. That is so wrong on so many levels. Oh, I gotta get it uh, back soon. Get what back? I was robbed uh, by a group of lens bandits. My family bow. It's been in my family for generations. They took it. Oh, I gotta get it back. I can take care of that for you. Y you would? Oh, thanks. I retrieved the bow from the bandits. Does it say where? No, but it is an indicator on where it is. I don't say which dungeon it is, but it's probably one of the four, so eventually we'll find it. <laughs> Alright, let's get uh, to Outlander Lane and start picking up all the store quests. Because th th those are plenty as well. CJ, come here for a minute. What's the matter, Sarita? You don't look happy. Have you heard about these champion black eggs then? Oi. Rajiv can buy bragging about how he's in is home to the town's very own delicacy, and how you and your pals helped him. Oh, not that I'm blaming you, pet. It's not your fault Rajiv has the most punchable face in town, after all. <laughs> wow. Okay, take it easy, Sarita. Please, help me with some new dishes, pet. I can't lose to Rajiv, I won't. I had the best idea, Sarita's red-hot lava fry-up. Would you mind uh, fetching me some good hot molten lava? <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. Technically, we can't eat the lava. Does she know that? But yeah, there's also a specific individual item from the lava ruins. Like I said, we need to travel to all dungeons and really, really thoroughly search them. Ah, oh, CJ, just the girl I wanted to see. Oh yeah, why is that? Well, I need some materials, and you're the only one I trust to gather them together. When's the last time you took a break? 
Well, all the adventurers are gearing up to protect the town for something. You know what that means. No rest for the smithy. I, I'd uh, go get the stuff myself, but I've got customers in and out every 10 minutes. Hmm, you certainly look like you could use a hand. Alright, leave it to me. High purity or we got plenty. <laughs> Sorry for the delay. This should be everything, right? Ah, oh, thanks a lot. No time to talk. Gotta keep on top of these orders. Alright, here, stamp. Final level for the smithy. Yes, it is. The stone, lapis lazuli. Oh, our calcum is definitely gonna be the last level. It has to be. Nope, <laughs> there are even more. Of course, I was thinking our calcum is basically the best item when uh, you come across it in games. Oh, we need so many lapis lazuli. Alright, I'm gonna make sure that everything is on level 22. And then we'll just need to grind some lapis lazuli. We, we know where we can get those, so it's no problem. Once or worm skin. Damn, that's a lot of upgrades. I mean, a hell of a lot of upgrades. Uh, giant chunk of ice. Well, I'd rather start upgrading uh, CJ's uh, armor, because she's the one we fight with the most, so she needs to be protected the most as well. Certain play. Uh, golden rubble. Even more? I think we got it. I think this is her max armor. <laughs> 80, uh, 30. Alright, so we got a chunk of ice. Alright, that is their old Isha maxed out. Yeah, this takes so much resource. And this is just only this one, so can you imagine with the other stores what we need to do? Ugh, it's gonna be one resource heavy upgrade system. Alright, let's uh, pick up some more quests. Oh, I can't believe it's so hard to find. Are you okay there, miss? Miss? I'm here. The cook. Don't you know me? Oh, and no, I'm not okay. Thought that I was kind enough to sharpen my chef's knife, but it was so sharp it cut through my cutting board. So I've been searching for a cutting board strong enough to cut on, but I can't find one anywhere. Ordinary wood just won't do it. It's got to be something tougher. Hmm, <laughs> I can try and find something for you. And of course, hard wood from the great forest, which we only have one left, so we need to gather up more. Oh, CJ. Could I trouble you for a moment of your time? Don't you always? Well, my store has become enormously successful. I declare without certainty that this is the finest weapon shop in Nunavay. It is the only weapon shop in Nunavay, but go on. Well, but every silver lining has a cloud, as they say. Some of my display swords have been succumbed to oxidation. As a swordsman myself, I can take no pride in a rusting blade. Whetstone is simply essential for me to continue. Say no more, please. You need some whetstone, right? Straight to the point as usual, CJ. Precisely. Alright. Well, uh, we found one before in the quarry and I know where that is. Maybe we can find another one at the same location? Hey, CJ! CJ, over here! <laughs> yes, Frida, I hear you. What's up? So, I installed some displays, right? Next thing I know, sales are going through the roof. And that's great, isn't it? Uh, it is, or it was, at first. But now I can't keep up with the demand. I've uh, been asked to help again and again and again, but do you know I think I could ask you one more time? <laughs> Why didn't you start with that? No problem. I'll get what you need. Uh, golem rubble in the barrels. Hmm, good enough. 
here. This should be everything, I hope. Oh, you're the best, CJ. What would I do without you? Here, stamp. Alright, next level armor shop. Let's see what we can. No new levels? You know it's level 5? Alright. I'll take it. So does it doesn't mean if we upgrade the weapon store we might be done there as well. That would be nice, but then we only need to focus on the items we are missing for Tatara Smithy. And that's it. Hey Rajiv, how's our town delicacy selling? Selling? <laughs> They're practically flying out the door. Honestly, I'm having a hard time keeping them on the shelves. Just never seem to have enough eggs. You need some more? I can go grab them for you. Oh, I appreciate that. Honestly, the pasturage is a little slow. We might need to build a second one at this rate. Oh, really? Hmm. Maybe I better go grab a whole bunch from Snow Peak then. Well, if you think that would be best, don't put yourself in danger on my account, though. And don't worry, I'll take care of it. Uh, yeah, I I've gathered up more Thunder Axe when I was exploring Snow Peak, so we've got enough. I've got a whole lot of eggs with your name on it, Rajiv. Oh, thank my lucky stars. Time to double up production. Only, it's gonna get busier from here on, I'd say. Here, take a stamp. Stamp received. Alright, that would probably mean that we can now have level 5 luck here. It is beautiful. Because you can never have enough luck when it comes to uh, exploring. Oh, CJ, I did it. I actually did it. You actually did what? The largest tote bag I've ever seen. I've made it. Wait, really? Sadly, I haven't been able to test it with anything particularly hot or particularly heavy. Don't suppose you'd like to volunteer to carry home a giant lava rock? A what? But that means we have to defeat the dragon down there. Well, take as long as you need. I'll be counting on you. Hmm, can't exactly refuse you now, can I? Well, so I've been Sabine. I still have one left. <laughs> well, we carried the giant lava rock all the way home, and the bag is none the worse for it. Incredible! Not as much as a split seam. I finally did it. The biggest, most durable pack to ever exist. <laughs> Congratulations, Jason. Stem time. Is it now level 5 or level 4? Level 5, okay. So, Rizzo's back is not gonna get any bigger. This one we can. And we have to resource it. Alright, so we're maxed out on these ones now as well. So it's probably three rows. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, we, we just let it fill up with anything random we uh, pick up along the way. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Something up? Well, oh, <laughs> I know you. You know my dad, right? The bag maker. I'm his daughter, Saloni. And <laughs> that's Topek's uh, Castolan. He got a pretty big order recently too. We are in big trouble without that stock. I suppose this is the handiworks of our bandit friends then. I think so, yeah. The goons who hang out around down in Barrows. <laughs> I'll go get it back for you. Really, you would? Oh, thank you. Damn, Barrows is a very popular quest location uh, today. Well, makes my job a lot easier. Oh, you're that CJ kid who's been making the rounds, right? Yep, and you are? Well, I'm Dete. I'm a sorcerer of some renown, you know. I'm currently trying to get my hands on some lightning slime material. Quite rare, from what I understand. Oh, there's plenty of lightning slimes in the barrel. I can get them for you if you want. I heard from York that you were a dependable adventurer. I see, he was correct. If you please. Of course. I'm back, and I got what you asked for. Oh, thank you very much, CJ. I'm in your debt. Give me that stamp.
Ah, CJ, Miss Isha. I dare say you must have known I wish to speak with you. If it's about Isha's power, we've already figured it out. Yes, and I learned a lot too of my unfortunate fate. Ah, yes, I've heard. My research brought me to the similar conclusions. Is that so? Well, then your research had reached its end. Oh, goodness, no. I only scratched the surface. The conclusion has been reached, yes, but I'm far from satisfied with it. I should like to delve deeper still. Hmm, not satisfied? You can't mean... I can and I do. I believe there may yet be hope to save you from that unfortunate fate of yours. It may take many years, but I'm quite sure something can be done. I owe you a great debt for allowing me to set up this forge here, so I intend to repay that debt. To that end, I should like to improve the forge even further. Oh, if it's materials you need, I'm your girl. Durable stone? Plenty. I got everything you asked for. Will this be enough to upgrade uh, what you have in mind? <laughs> you have my thanks. My research shall continue in earnest. <laughs> Thank you, Jörg. Oh, quick, take your stamp. I must begin building at once. So many quests. So many quests. Alright. Alright, we already maxed this out at level 3. So it's just like the armor store. Like, the store has been upgraded, but there just isn't anything uh, to improve anymore. That's fine. It does give us a few extra stems. He's already level 5. Ooh, we have 143 stems, but we did already get uh, the critical mass and impossible luck from ending the game itself. Shall we then just go for eternal bonds? Allows you to perform unlimited link attacks. Could be extremely powerful. Yeah, we're, like always, we're not gonna go for the resources because we can just gather them up. It's much more fun than just buying them at the trading post. All right, let's sell some of our value goods just for some uh, additional cash. Because I do think that eventually we will get in trouble with uh, <laughs> our lack of money. Oh, hi there, little lady. Thanks to you, the tool business has been doing real, real well. <laughs> well, glad I could help. Problem is... Problem is what? The more stock I sell, the less stock I have. I have been selling a lot, so I'm just about all out. What do you say, little lady? Care to help me out? <laughs> sure. Wait here, I'll get what you need. Here it's your... No problem. I'm back. And <laughs> this should do, right? Oh, this will very do very nicely indeed, little lady. I owe you one yet again. <laughs> Anytime. Alright. Alright, what kind of tools can we do? Nothing. <laughs> just like before, already maxed everything out. The shop is just better for it. And the last one with Squash. Hey Squash, looks like business is booming. Booming indeed. I am afraid I would uh, prefer it to boom a little bit less, quite frankly. I'm rapidly running out of stock. Could I trouble you to fetch some materials on my behalf? <laughs> no trouble at all, I'll be right back. And I'll be right here. Plenty of ore in stock. I'm back, I got the materials you wanted. Oh, thank you, thank you. Allow me to stamp your card for you. Alright. Alright, so we got a lot of uh, level 5 ones. Uh, the ones we are missing for the level 5, who we can now technically make in store. I'll figure out which one it is and get them made. So, collecting resources will be even easier for us. Alright, so let's head back to the plaza and see if we are missing any more quests. <laughs> I think we are. Hey, hey, you there, L little, little girl. Are you talking to me? <laughs> Look at you, 
adventure. Your mama must be <laughs> proud. Ugh. You are one of them adventurers too? I, I was robbed by a band of brigands. Brigands? You mean like bandits? You think they might have left it behind? I it's a small bag after all. And there's much nicer stuff to steal down than barrows. Sure, just wait here. Ah, this must be that errand uh, Preta mentioned. Okay, so basically, if we retrieve it for him, he might be able to go back home. Yeah, we, we, we cannot deny him that. <laughs> uh, one more. Jochon at the Great Forest, yeah, we haven't been there yet, so let's go there. Pick up the laws of our open quests. This is <laughs> the end. Are you okay? Uh, Jochen, it's my name. <laughs> I was attacked in the woods. Waves of enemies. Waves? But they could be on their way here. What attacked you? Uh, cotton flies. Cotton? Flies? You mean the fluffy things? They overwhelmed me. <laughs> well, you are bleeding. You need some self and soon. Uh, if I had some of those slime herbs from the forest, which you would heal in no time. Okay, so just grab some herb around the great forest. Okay, so we definitely need to go over every inch of the room barrel. And of course we got the some quest in the quarry and the great forest too, of course. So I'm saying I do know already about one of them in the quarry. And I think I wanna save the room barrels itself for next time. That way we can spend the whole chunk of time of the next episode just exploring the entire room barrows in order to find all the items we need and it's a lot, trust me. So let's pick up what we have. I think it was at the fishing spot. Maybe not. <laughs> Oh no, there was a fishing spot at the room barrows. I think uh, in here? I think it was uh, at the whetstone location. And the best way to get there is just from the start of the quarry. Because it's actually really, really close. You just go down the first shaft you see, then double back, and you'll be there. Uh, how can you get hurt by these fluffy things? It's almost impossible, if you ask me. Not everybody can be as strong as CJ, but. While we're here, hopefully we can also find uh, a secondary whetstone. Because this is the place where we found it, the first one. Ooh, yes it is! Come on, Guru, you can take this. Without his shield, he's done. Should have known that he also has a backlash. Well, like I said, nothing that he can do uh, about me. I'm too powerful now. Trap set. And another quest the jar. these two things out. Let's check our quest list to see if there's anything else we need to find at the quarry. And these things that we haven't completed yet. Lava ruins, quarry is found. Also found. Yeah, I think uh, 
we found everything well, maybe except the bow because don't say where it is so it could be here as well but I think the bow would be one of those things we just need to go look and find ourselves it would be best if it was also in the room bear singing as we're gonna explore that place inside and out all right so I think I'm gonna leave it here next time we're gonna explore the entirety of the room barrels just to fill in all those quests and after that if we have the time we'll finish up the last few great forest ones and see what kind of quests we uh, still have open because I don't think it's just about 50 I think we're missing like one or two uh, short of that we, we could check there's no number is there okay let's uh, see one two three Okay, so it is a 12 quest, we need 15, so we're still gonna get like 3 quests after we completed all of these. So maybe follow-ups? Which should be more than fine, more than we can handle. So there is a good chance that the next episode will be a very long one, as it is like the final episode to the entire series. So we will just take all the time we need to complete any quest we have, to fill up my last stamp card and call it officially done but yes for now i'll leave it here and i wish you all a great night morning day wherever you are and if you manage to still be here after the end of the episode don't forget to hit that like button subscribe and be back next time for the last episode in the series <laughs> bye bye